In broken Washington, people pretend to solve problems while doing nothing. The border, taxes, war. Washington loves perpetual issues that enable one side to raise money off the other. And Washington loves long wars that fill the pockets of the elite. But now, people who love faith, family, freedom, just as Americans do, are forced to fight or die because they will not surrender to evil. Sure, we've got some bad folks in DC, but they pale in comparison to Moscow, which every day murders and persecutes Christians on Ukrainian soil. Under Russia, there's no freedom of speech or religion. Speaker Mike Johnson, now, his eyes are opened. And it demands American leadership. And so he pushed for the Ukraine aid, but he demanded that the White House send not just token life support, but long-range weapons that will get the job done. The very weapons the White House has been reluctant to send. Ukrainians stand for the virtues that are slipping in the USA. If we can help Ukraine, we will also have begun to fix Washington, where people pretend to solve problems while doing nothing. Are we ready to abandon our age of acrimony? To start solving problems and, yes, to actually become heroes? If we turn our backs right now, the consequences could be devastating.